You know, there's just something so deep here, right? It's like, it's really like the artist just knew my life story. You know, it's, uh, it's, quilting is just so therapeutic. Have you ever quilted? I did when I was a girl, but I haven't did it much since my grandma left. You might want to pick it back up. See, my family, we, we have a quilt that we carry on from generation to generation. And uh, you know, it's just something about a good quilt. It, uh, it carries this beautiful weight. And you know, it makes me feel oddly safe. See, mine was handcrafted by the delicate fingers of the women that came before me. Each square is symbolic of one of life's dealings, so each carries a deeper meaning for me. Let's start here. This is my great grandmother's beautiful wide reaching tree. And those are its blood stained branches. The painful reminder of life in a sundown town and how its strange fruit dances. Or doesn't. Or maybe it used to. Hmm. Or let's move to this. This is an addition by my grandma. Piggy pink dollar sign symbol symbolic of black business. In a time where barter carried more power than dollars, so in terms of community relations, that was the litmus. So you know when you come up filling bellies and feeding souls, you gotta make sure that story gets told. But she also backed it with this motif. Rays of black, red, and green symbolizing grief. The unexpected loss of her father pushed a full-time working wife and mother into a business partner. And you know, this one resonates most with me. It's different generations and different tragedies, but the sadness and the responsibility it's a commonality. But then we have my mother's, we have my mother's beautiful black rose applique. Yeah, that was from my mother. It was symbolic of the strength and courage that it takes to leave less than gentle lovers. And it was perfectly placed on to brown hues, which represents her deep roots. And it was bound with vivid purple threads because no matter what was working against her in this life, she made sure to always lift her head. So, I guess you can say there's history sewn into my cover, and it, it can be a bit heavy. And you know, there's spots where the stitching will be a bit messy, but that's just the way life is. And one day I'll add to this quilt while teaching my daughter the comfort in its stitchery. But for today, I'm gonna sit here wearing my family's quilt as it comforts me with the memories. Go quilt, sis. Give him a round of applause.